summertime, and that's great for the outdoor activities, but it can certainly take a toll on our skin. This morning, we were talking about how to keep your face totally radiant. Here to tell us about the antioxidant benefits to keep you away from the free radicals, Kim Whitaker from the Center PC. Thank you so Hi. much for joining you, us. Lisa. You look fabulous today, Thank by the you. way. And look at the perfect skin, right? <laughs> the proof is in the pudding. That's all I got to say. Absolutely. So, for everybody out there who doesn't know, because I'll be honest with you, when I was first doing this research, I was like, free radicals. You hear them all the time. What mm -hmm. exactly are they? Free radicals are scavengers or thieves. And what they do is they attack our skin. Um, it's unfortunate we can't escape them. They mm -hmm. are pollutants, um, sunlight. We get them from sunlight. We also get them from cigarette smoke. Plus, our body produces them. They're a respiratory byproduct. It's a constant battle. It is, what you're telling absolutely. me. absolutely. <laughs> well, now, where do these, you know, we talked about where these things came from. Basically, we actually have some graphics here that we can do. kind of show what's happening to the skin at the time of all of this, We right? hear the word antioxidant all the time, but people probably don't understand really what they are doing for our skin. So, the free radicals are actually scavengers. They're stealing what they need from our skin, from healthy cells. Okay. And they're creating a chain reaction because if they're going to take what they need from healthy cells, that healthy cell then becomes a free radical. So it has to turn to the next cell. It's going to take it from that cell and so on. So it becomes this snowball effect, and we're just wreaking havoc on our bodies and our skin as a result. And to put it in layman terms, what we're really talking about here is when this stuff happens, we're talking about aging skin. We're talking about wrinkles, right? Absolutely. Sagging, um, dehydration, all of those things are causes plus you know skin cancer also um, we're seeing some uh, skin cancer problems as a result of free radical activity now antioxidants mm -hmm. everybody knows good for the body we Absolutely. always talk about all that stuff how are they actually good for the skin um, topically they're going to protect that skin okay obviously internal indig or digestible products are not always going to protect the skin from the outside because we are being attacked on the outside by mm -hmm. pollutants and things like that so applying it to the skin is going to protect the face from the wrinkling, the sagging, and all of those things. So you want to uh, choose a topical cream or serum for the skin that is going to penetrate. What's an example of a good one out there? Because I look at all of the stuff when I go to like oh. the Target or the Walmart. <laughs> I'm like, I got nothing. Absolutely. Um, some good topicals are vitamins A, C, and E. We've got green tea is a great one. A new one, um, which is extremely potent antioxidant, is coffee berry. No way. Mm -hmm. well, why um, is it so potent specifically? Well, they found it to be the highest rated on this particular scale they use to rate antioxidants. It actually protects the coffee bean. It's the berry around the coffee bean. Huh. So if you imagine that the coffee bean is in a, an environment that's very hot and humid, it is protecting that bean. So if you think about it, it's going to protect our skin also if it can protect that particular bean. Yeah. I like this, and there are mm -hmm. actually some things that you can eat, and on my list, dark chocolate dark actually <laughs> helps your skin. Is it just me, or does that make you glow? <laughs> Absolutely. And wine, too. And, and red wine. wine. <laughs> Ladies, we need to just have a little bit of a party is what we need to do. Red wine, a little bit of that chocolate, good stuff. Absolutely. Some other good things, though. Broccoli was on that list. What else do we Broccoli, have? Broccoli, blueberries, pomegranate, your fruits, um, green leafy vegetables, all of those things ingested are going to help your body, um, but also your skin to some extent. But remember, really topical antioxidants are the best for the skin. You know, seek out your health, your skin health professional to find out which product is going to be best for you and to fit that into your regimen. Okay. Awesome. Such great information. Thank you so much for helping Thank us you. stay beautiful out there. All of this information, which is very helpful, is going to be on our website, fox28.com. You can check it out. Kim, thank you so much. And thank you. I really appreciate it because I'm going to use all these tips great. and have some chocolate today. <laughs> all right. All right. Well,